Spadina, Fort York. Mr. Speaker, whistleblower information from HSBC documents show rampant mortgage fraud by people using fake high salaries from fake jobs in China to get mortgages and buy houses in Canada. How is yeah. it possible for a person with no income to buy four houses? These frauds fuel real estate bubbles and they support FinTrack That's pretty insane. on Chinese, Chinese money laundering and Canadian real estate. How can the Prime Minister make housing more available and, f- and affordable when fraudsters are buying up multiple homes? Why is this government ignoring the damage created by money laundering and mortgage fraud in Canada? The Right Honourable Prime Minister. Mr. Speaker, just a few days ago, we reinforced and extended our foreign home buyers ban uh, to make sure that homes in Canada are used by Canadians to live in, not as investment vehicles for uh, for foreign entities or foreign owners. Uh, this is part of our broad plan uh, that invests in more housing, that increases supply, and ensures that ca- families are able to afford uh, the future they want to build for their kids in their communities right across the country. We're stepping up on housing. We will continue to do so while the Conservatives have no plan. Right, right. I wish to draw to the attention of members in the presence of the gallery. Thanks for watching the video to the very end. If you'd like to subscribe, I've made it very easy. You can do so by clicking right there. If you'd like to watch another House of Commons highlight clip, you can do so by clicking right there. And if you'd like to subscribe to my main channel, Mr. Sunshine Baby, where it's all Canadian political news, then you can do so by tapping up there. Um, subscribing is absolutely free. There's a button down below that says subscribe. If you'd like to join and become a member and financially contribute, you could do so as well. Thank you so much for watching this video.